I'm Mrs. York and this is the Picking a Pet performance task. Are you ready to get started? Let's take a look at the scenario. Picking a pet. Your class is trying to decide what type of animal to get for the class pet. That sounds fun. Your teacher is letting the class vote to choose a goldfish, a turtle, or a hamster as the class pet. All 20 students in your class voted for both their first choice and their second choice for the class pet, and the results are shown in table one. So here in the table, we can see there are 20 students in the class, and for each of those 20 students, we see what the first choice for a pet was and the second choice. So that's all the information we need to answer the questions. You ready for question one? Picking a pet. It says, using the class data shown in table one, complete the following frequency table. So it has the three pets listed there and it's asking us to show total first choice votes and then total second choice votes. So the total number of first choice votes, we just need to count them up for each of those three pets. Okay, so goldfish, we wanna count how many first choice votes for goldfish. So we're just gonna count. So first choice is this column. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven first choice votes for goldfish. So we'll just enter that into our table. And so now let's count how many total first choice votes for the hamster. So we're back to that first choice column and we have one, two, three, four, four first choice votes for the hamster. And now first choice votes for the turtle. Same columns, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine first choice votes for the turtle. And so now we need to enter into the table the total second choice votes for each of those same pets. So we'll go back to the table and now we'll be looking at the column titled second choice. We'll count for goldfish first. So we'll go down the second choice column. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight second choice votes for the goldfish. And now we'll count second choice votes for the hamster. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, first, or excuse me, second choice votes for the hamster. And now lastly, the second choice votes for the turtle. The total number is, back to that same column, the turtle, we have one, two, three, four, five. Five second choice votes for the turtle. And that's all we need to do to solve problem number one.